I know what you mean. Um, just to let you know as well that Dan Wooten now works for the Daily Mail. Does a lot of celebrity pieces. I've got to read one about him saying that Johnny Depp's not part of the council culture. That would be an interesting read. Um, but I've got to show you something. And I don't know if many people know this because he did delete it. But Twitter is on it. Let me just pull up these pictures. So... <laughs> Take a look at this. This was in 2016. Um, you can see here that he was actually against Amber and for Johnny. And this is actually deleted now. But they managed to keep the receipts. Um, just take a good look. Pause it if you need to. And I'm just going to show the development of how it changed. Here is just another photo of him responding to a comment against Amber and how he did think like this. I don't know what caused this change. I'd be curious to find out. If anyone does know, please comment. Um, and then I'll just show you the next one. Pause it if you need it, though. And then we have this one from November 2020. See, I'm trying to figure out whether he changed the narrative to be a part of the Me Too movement. Maybe that would make him more popular. Maybe that's his game. Maybe it's something he's doing to try and get higher up in the world um, in terms of his career. But <laughs> deleting it, like, we are allowed to change our opinions, do you know what I mean? Um, I'm just going to change this to a different green screen. I just wanted to share it all with you because it's interesting how people change their narrative and delete things without saying why and how their opinions have changed. I'm curious whether someone spoke to him, whether it could have been his job that influenced him, or maybe it could have even been Amber. Um, but just be aware that he does work for the Daily Mail now. Um, we'll see what happens. They've already been against Johnny in that one too. I think they should be careful because the more mainstream media that goes against Johnny without showing evidence and just taking Amber's side for no reason... I don't think it's going to go well. I mean, the petition's already got over 4 million signatures and that's a lot of people to be behind Johnny. And, like, yeah, it's it's interesting. I wanted to share it all with you. I can't believe he deleted it. Um, thanks all for responding. Let me know what you think. I'll get to the comments. Um, and thank you, Christine, for all your comments. You've been awesome. Thanks so much.